putting these four screws around the base. Carefully flip everything back over, set it down gently. Okay, so we're ready to take the bottom section off. This has the windings in it and the dead hall sensors that we need to try see if we can fix. Okay, so we're going to very carefully lift this off. It's free. There we go. Okay. Oh, that's pretty hard. Been working on removing the hall sensors that are dead in this turbo. And I think we finally got this one loose. Yep, there we go. So you can see I've scratched out traces in the epoxy where new wires will have to be stuck in somehow. You can see there's the other hall sensor. And so they're 90 degrees opposed from each other. You can see both of them right there. I'm going to try to give an example of how I was digging out this epoxy in here with a modified dental tool turned into a little chisel. And so you get it in and you just walk it along and it digs out the epoxy. You can see comes right out. So this is the shape of the tool. Right here, I'll focus in on that a little bit more. So it's flat pointed chisel. And I'm replacing the circuit board out of this turbo pump that had the hall sensors on it. This is the original circuit board that shows the spot where the hall sensors were. The hall sensors were right in the middle of those little circles. Here's the new sensors and they line up perfectly on those little circles. So hopefully that's close enough to get the right sort of pulses out of this and get the turbo pump working again. We'll see. I just finished soldering in the new hall sensors and I think I might actually be able to just use it without putting any epoxy in at all. We'll have to see how the clearances look. There you can see one hall sensor. And this is not the cleanest soldering job in the world but I did what I could. There's the other hall sensor. You can see the connections. So the top two wires are just left free because we don't need to connect anything to them at the moment. So we replaced the hall sensors in here. Got one here and one here. I put the turbo back together.
I think that's a success.